Lesson 7, uh, normal strain. So, dito na tayo sa strain. Uh, I think na-cover na natin lahat ng mga introductory part ng stress. So, normal strain is just an elongation or contraction of a line segment per unit length. Okay? So, actually, meron tayong dalawang uh, strain. You have the normal and shear strain. So, unahin natin yung normal strain. This is uh, just elongation or contraction. So, paghaba or pag-contract ng uh, isang material. Okay? So, for example, you have here material, tapos nag-apply ka ng force, uh, which is uh, tension. So, uh, meron kang elongation dito. No? Bali, humaba yung, uh, for example, stretchable to steel, for example. Tapos, hinila mo. Or nag-apply ka ng tension. So, meron kang uh, nadagdag na, or na stretch or elongation dito na equal to this uh, particular symbol. So, bali, ito yung symbol natin for deformation. So, deformation, again, is just the change in size and shape. So, deformation yung tawag natin pag naka-experience ng normal strain at shear strain yung isang bagay. No? But in this case, uh, normal strain lang to. So, this is deformation or the change in length. So, ito ngayon yung uh, bagong length natin, yung L prime. And then, this is the original length. So, ito yung original length natin, which is uh, denoted by L. So, the average normal strain for this uh, particular segment is deformation divided by the original length. Okay? Or deformation is just equal to L prime minus L. Ito no? L prime. Pali, ito yung buong L prime. Minus L is just equal to deformation. Okay? So, deformation divided by L. So, pag negative yung uh, answer nito, ibig sabihin, contraction. No? Ibig sabihin, mas, mas lumiit yung uh, segment mo compared sa original niya na uh, dimension. And kung positive naman, ibig sabihin, elongation. So, na-stretch yung material mo. Okay? So, sample problem, a thin strip of rubber has an unstretched length of uh, 15 inches. If it is uh, stretched around a pipe, so, isang, uh, pipe, so ibig sabihin cylindrical, having, out, having an outer diameter of 5 inches, determine the average normal strain in the strip. So, ngayon, uh, aalamin muna natin no, kung ano yung circumference ng uh, pipe. Para malaman natin kung na-stretch ba or hindi na naman kailangan, hindi naman kailangan i-stretch siya para uh, ma-ano siya nung rubber natin. Ma-fully wrap siya ng rubber natin yung uh, pipe. Okay? The circumference of the pipe is just pi D. Given the uh, diameter, you have pi times uh, 5 inches, 15.71. And uh, you know that our... Um, Original length is uh, 5 inches, ah, 15 inches. Ibig sabihin, meron kang sobrang 0.71 inches. So, ang deformation natin ngayon is 15.71 minus 15 inches. So, that's uh, 0.71 divided by 15 equals uh, stress average. 0.04733 inch per inch. Bakit na kailangang average yung kunin? No? Kung makikita mo dito sa segment natin, uh, obvious naman na di, uh, parang dito ka naghila, dito ka nag-apply ng tension force, tapos dito na inagay. Pero not necessarily na ang material mo, dito lang siya na stretch. Pwedeng nag-stretch din dito, nag-stretch dito, or hindi mo talaga actually alam no? kung saan specifically sa, sa length ng ating segment na stretch yung uh, ating material. So, ibig sabihin, kailangan average na lang yung kukunin para... Uh, in effect, parang kinonsider natin na lahat ng um, dx or lahat ng ano ba tawag doon, infinitesimal uh, dimension or length ng ating material ay nag-stretch. So, average, inch per inch. So, ito yung bali yung uh, na-stretch, inch per inch. Yun yung normal strain, no? Um, yun, elongation sa <laughs> contraction lang. So, anyway, magbibigay ba tayo ng sample problem nito? Uh, so, but for this uh, particular uh, video, yun lang muna. So, Thank you again for uh, uh, joining. See you sa sample problem natin sa next na video. Okay. So, thank you.